What's up, Team Machine, and welcome to Detective VR, the demo. Now, in this demo, I'm going to be using my hands and my hands only, with no controllers, and that's because this game uses 100% hand tracking. Now, using my hands, I'm going to be exploring crime scenes, trying to find clues to find out exactly what happened at that particular crime scene. I'm going to be taking pictures, dusting for fingerprints, all that good stuff. Alright, so let's go ahead and see if we can crack these cases in Detective VR, the demo. Well, that's it. Welcome. It's your first step in the VR room. Normally, we'd have a whole training session ahead of us, right. but we're in a hurry. A new investigation has just arrived. Hi. Whoa. So you just make a hole in my floor, that's how Grab we're doing it? Grab the VR it. glasses, I'll load the crime scene. Let's do it. See? There goes my hands. Of course, a glass perfect. Nice. It's loading. Uh-oh. Whoa, who's that? Here it is. This is Richard Little bloody Stew. dude. He disappeared three days ago. He was an eccentric artist who had enjoyed some success with his latest collection. The kind of attention that can make people envious. Ooh, okay. And here's the artist's latest painting. I won't comment on that. Okay. We have a new investigation technique at our disposal. Let's see what this painting can tell us. Let's do it. Try to take a picture of it. Put your hand together in this position and pinch your finger. Okay. Perfect. Keep your fingers pinched and your hands apart. Fantastic. Nice. You've collected your first... Little Polaroid. Shake it like a Polaroid picture. Ooh, the detective board. That's your detective board. This is where you can organize your evidence and link it to a suspect. Okay. As you progress, you'll unlock new suspects. You see the drawing pin? Yes. If you grab it, you can link the evidence to a suspect. Ooh. Well, 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 well. Damn. Congratulations. You are now ready to enter the crime scene and collect all the other clues. Let's do it. Take a look at the right side of the detective board and push on the big red button. Got it. Here you are at the crime scene. What a mess. Oh boy. You're going to have to find out what happened here. To start, you need to collect the clues around the scene. I see one clue. To get clue. around, I'm going to open some teleportation points. Let's do Simply it. Simply pinch in their direction to teleport. Alright, let's do it. And let's collect some evidence. Okay, so I see we got broken glass. Don't forget that you can take photos by putting okay. your hands together and pinching. Let's take this photo right here. The window Bam. was smashed by a punch. So we got seven of them. Got it. All right. We got some blood here. Let's do that. Someone some stepped footprints. on a puddle of blood. Nice. All right, I see we got a knife over in the painting. So let's take that. Ooh, that's a little dagger there. Let's see. Bam. A painting with a knife stuck in it. What's this, a book? A fire has started in a, a rubbish fire. Bin. Some documents oh, have survived Oh, look at the this. Flames. We got some blood in the sink. Somebody tried to clean their tracks. All right. There we go. We got a phone right here. Agatha's what voice we got? message One is more? particularly spicy. She seems to have something against Richard. Let's see. Uh, the swing? Oh, I did not see that. There we go. Insurance and valuation of Richard Hughes' works nice. at the request of A. Cohen. There we go. Awesome, you've gathered all the clue in the crime scene. Got it. We have a new suspect, Agatha Cohen, Richard's ex-girlfriend. Let's go back to our detective board. Let's do it. Walk to the circle in the center and press the red button. Ooh, there's our new suspect. Press on the big red button to go back to the detective board. It's actually white. I have the info. It's added to the detective board. Okay. Ta-da! 
so... Actually, I didn't tell you everything. What? It's not just about linking clues to suspects. You have to find evidence from the clues. Right. Look here. This is your pedestal. It's a central part of our investigation. Okay. It allows us to generate evidence and observe it. Let's see. The shards of glass face inwards, so it was a blow from the outside. Oh. A robbery? I see, Neil. Here we go. Blood type. A positive. Got it. Magnificent. Okay. You've collected all the evidence on this clue. Now all that remains is to connect our evidence to our suspect. A positive, right? Let's put that there. Bam. So, if you connect a clue to the evidence of the right suspect, you create a special link. Right. A suspicion. What do we got? Hmm. We got some blood type. Where? You just found the blood evidence. Oh, snap. That's probably our victims, right? We got fingerprints now, right? Let's see. A footprint in a blood stain. There we go. Can you read it? A bare Bam. foot corresponding to a size nine or ten stepped in blood. Yep. No blood tight. The blood is nice. impressive. This is literally the most common blood Shit ain't group. looking too good for you, Richard. Is one of our suspects A positive? Absolutely positively. Okay, let's put that back. Bam. Ooh, it is not looking good for you, Richard. All right, let's go with the cell phone next. This is probably... This is Richard Hughes' mobile phone. Right. The last thing played was a voice message from Agatha Cohen. In a nutshell, Agatha's... You just found the fingerprint proof. Oh, that's our boy Richard. That's our boy Richard. What else we got? The last thing played was a voice message sent by Agatha Cohen. Oh. Okay. So that can link both of them, right? We got any blood? No blood. Alright. Let's grab this. So we got both of them. Oh. Wait, what? Let's do the knife. We'll probably get a print. The blood-like color of the paint is strange. As if it were organic. A particularly striking work. Was perforating the work part of the artistic process? Maybe. Alright, let's switch to the fingerprint. There we go. There are fingerprints on the back and sides of the canvas. Oh, that looks like Agatha. Someone transporting the work? Can I link these prints to a suspect? Oh, absolutely, positively. That's Agatha all the way. Let's see. You just found the special proof. Richard Hugh. Got him. Alright. Where does this go? Let's do this. Oh. 
No? There we go. But see, it had his signature, didn't it? Let's check this. Not everything in this rubbish bin has caught fire. I have been able to analyze the evidence. More prints. Multiple fingerprints are present. All belonging to the same person. Yup. Yeah. Oh, Richard. You just found the special proof. And that's her, Agatha Cohen. Alright. We don't got no blood, right? Let's do it. But can I do multiple strings? Alright. So what do we got left? We got this. We need to find a fingerprint. But where? There it is. You just found the fingerprint proof. Nice. Alright. Let's put that back. What do we got? The paper. One more. Let's get it. Insurance and valuation of Richard Hughes works at the request of A. Cohen. You just found the fingerprint proof. That's hers. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, snap. Agatha seems to be behind this contract. Yep. She's the beneficiary. Let's do this. Good. Now what? Find three blood, three fingerprints, three name. Agatha testimony. So... How do I do this? Bravo! Your first suspicion is created. Take it and place it on the pedestal. Okay. Try to see Agatha begin to react to your suspicions. It's up to you to find the right combinations to unlock a new testimony. I have nothing to say about it. Oh. Okay. Let's see. What about that? Listening to it now, I might have been a bit intense. Right. But if I hadn't, our story would have continued. Anyway, I meant what I said that day. What's that? Okay. Let's see. Then we got... Go. Have you read my article? It's definitely worth a look. Is it? It's all there. Oh. I can't get it. There we go. Bam. What about that? Yeah, you're cooked. I spent a year with him, so obviously you're going to find my fingerprints all over the place. Oh, okay. What do we got? New crime scene unlocked. Look, look, I don't want to talk about it. What? I think I felt trapped. I couldn't move on with Richard. We knew it would come out sooner or later. Oh. He needs an enormous amount of space to create, an enormous amount of space for his ego. Right. So you killed him. Staying with Richard just felt like putting my career on hold. Yeah. Here we go. We're about to see it all unfold. We are in Agatha's testimony, and now we can explore the timeline. Look at your watch. Can you go back in time? At the beginning of the timeline, I think I saw something. What? What? 
What'd you say? Oh! Here we go. This is a ceremonial knife from Central Africa. Nice. An object of great museum value. A letter from the Centre d'Art Contemporain Pompidou. Yeah, whatever Paris. that means. Oh, don't tell me. Richard seems to have serious debts. But how did he get into this situation? Let's see. Oh boy. Agatha's mobile received a text message from a yep. museum. Oh, I'm about to nail this girl. Contract was mishandled. Huh. Richard must not have appreciated the terms and conditions. Alright, let's rewind. Hmm. Interesting. Let's see who's texting Agatha. Perfect. Nice. I'll open up the other teleportation points for you. Good. There are several clues hidden in the timeline. Get this calendar. What the heck is that? Oh, that's dangerous. A very original way of marking an important yep. date. Alright, what do we got? Let's see. I got that already. What's... A missed call from Carl Von Rove on Richard's phone. Yes. Let's get that. Oh! Uh, sorry, I'm up in your face, buddy. Sorry. Alright. Play. Who are you texting, girl? A note signed by Carl Von nice. Rove. It says, Friendly Reminder. Let's see what happens. Oh, okay. Yeah. Richard, we need to talk. Uh-oh. Talk about what? About us. Yeah, she wants to talk, all right. And by talk, she wants to slice that throat. Well, there you have it, folks. There goes the demo for Detective VR. 100% hand tracking. I want to give a shout out to Alexander. I'm not quite sure of the studio name. I think it's Cheapo something. Studio Cheapo. I'm sorry, Alexander, if I'm saying that wrong. But Alexander from Cheapo, he's the one who sent me this demo. I want to give a shout out to him. So you guys can expect this soon. I don't know if they're going to release the demo um, anytime soon or if they're going to release it on early access but man I think it's awesome and I will say this is the first time I've used complete hand tracking and I loved it man it's awesome not having to hold the controllers but uh yeah man so there you go detective VR the demo can't wait to try more catch you guys on the next one later